Hi, my name is Christian Donovan and I'm the Director of Performance Marketing at 3B1. One of the most tedious tasks involved in managing a Google Ads account is going through all of the search terms your ads showed up for and filtering out negative keywords. We used to be able to make the job a little bit easier by being hyper-focused and using exact match keywords, which would show up only when the search term exactly matched your keyword. However, lately, Google has broadened the definition of exact and taken control away from the advertiser. So now your ads can show on searches that they really shouldn't. Going through those long lists of search terms, which are often in the thousands, takes a lot of time. Well, today I want to share a way around some of that tedious work with an automated negative keyword script by Marius Blau. The end result will be that any search terms in the last seven days that don't exactly match your keywords will be automatically added as a negative. How to automate negative keywords for Google Ads. Create a copy of the spreadsheet included below. In your Google Sheet, toggle auto exclude non-exact matches to yes. Open Google Ads and log into your account. Label any ad groups you want the script to have an effect on with the label Automate Negatives. Note capitalization is important here. In the left menu, select Tools, Bulk Actions and then Scripts. Click the blue plus icon and select New Script. Name your script something descriptive like Negative Keyword Automation Script. Copy the script included below into the main code area and make sure you paste over or erase any existing code. Add the link to your spreadsheet between the quotation marks on line 3. Click Run and then click Authorize. Now go out to your scripts and set it to Run Daily and it'll automatically add new negative keywords every day. There's loads more useful data in this Google Sheet. It'll tell you everything about which keywords were removed, what they spent, if they converted and much more. You can then use that data to decide if you'd be better off adding that keyword to your campaign instead of excluding it. Want to learn more? Follow me on LinkedIn or follow 3B1 on YouTube for regular insights and strategies.